What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of Smell What Cooper's Cooking. On today's episode, I got a piece of flank steak. I gotta do something with it, so I'm gonna show you guys one of my go-to steak marinades. But before we get started, the full recipe is in the description. If you guys like what I got going on here, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Let's go! What's cracking everybody? All right, for today's steak marinade, the ingredients that I'm gonna be using to flavor up this bad boy are red onion, we're gonna be slicing that up. Gonna introduce some citrus to this meat by using the juice of three oranges and three limes. A few tablespoons of minced garlic. Got a tablespoon of black pepper. About four tablespoons of carne asada seasoning. Got some cilantro there in the front and chilling in the back. I've got extra virgin olive oil and Worcestershire sauce. And last but not least, I have a one pound beautiful piece of flank steak. Flank steak is a really lean cut of beef, so it does well with some marination. And that's exactly what we're gonna do today. Full recipe is in the description. Now let's get it. I'm gonna start by slicing a red onion. I'm gonna cut that bad boy in half. Take one of those halves and cut it into slices. Go ahead and set that aside when you're done. Next, I'm gonna need about a quarter cup of cilantro, so I'm gonna pick a few leaves out of that bunch. Cut the stems off and go ahead and chop it on up. Coming into the scene next, I've got my trusty, dusty hand juicer. I'm gonna go ahead and slice up my three limes in half and press those down into my juicer to extract all that delicious citrus flavor. While I'm juicing up these limes and oranges, it's as good as time as any to go ahead and hit that like button. Make sure you're subscribed. Tell your friends, tell your foes about it. And make sure y'all hit that bell so you don't miss any of these hot episodes. All right, now that our onions have been sliced, our cilantro has been chopped, and our citrus has been juiced, let's go ahead and get the bag out and start adding these flavors together. So, in a Ziploc bag, I'm going to add half of my onions and cilantro to the bottom. Next, I'll go in with my one pound of flank steak. Now I'm tossing in my three tablespoons of minced garlic, one tablespoon of black pepper, four tablespoons of that carne asada seasoning, one quarter cup of Worcestershire sauce, one third cup of extra virgin olive oil going in as well. Now let's go ahead and add in the rest of our sliced red onions and our chopped cilantro. Get all that into the bag. Now let's hit it with a little bit of citrus love and get in all of that lime and orange juice into our bag. Go ahead and pour that over the top of all those ingredients we got in our marinade. Now let's go ahead and close up the bag, force out all that air so we have nothing but our delicious marinade goodness and that meat inside the bag. All right, now let's go ahead and pick up the bag, rub all that love into the meat. Make sure you get all those delicious flavors all over that beautiful piece of flank steak. And once you got that marinade adequately rubbed all over your steak, let's go ahead and pop this in the fridge. And you wanna let this marinade for at least six hours up to 24. I think I'm gonna take it to that 24 hour mark. And now after a 24 hour period has passed, also called a day, let's get this flank steak out and see exactly how our marinade took. Pop open the bag, let you guys see inside all that delicious cilantro, onions, garlic, carne asada seasoning. We got extra virgin olive oil, a bunch of orange and lime juice, 
Man, this steak came out fire. Let's get it out of the bag and lay it down on a tray so you guys can see exactly how good this cut of meat turned out. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, marinated flank steak. On this week's episode, I showed you guys how to marinate the steak. Check out next week's episode to see exactly what I do with it. Thank you for rocking with your boy for another episode of Smell What Koopa's Cooking. If y'all are feeling the content, hit that like button. Make sure you're sharing with your friends and your foes. But right now, I gotta go. Hey, there you have it, you guys. A delicious flank steak marinade. We let that one go for 24 hours. Check out the next episode, and I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I'm gonna do with it. Until then, don't forget to like, subscribe, share a friend or foe. You already know. And we'll catch you guys right back here next week for another episode of Smell What Koopa's Cooking.